In this video, I will show you how to use the Easy Park app. So what you want to do first is just download the Easy Park app for whatever country you are in. So for me, as you can see, it's Easy Park NL, but it can be any of the Easy Park apps since they are pretty much the same. Now, once you have installed it on your phone, simply open it up and then a map like this will open up. Now you need to give them access to your location. And if you do that, then it will automatically go to your location. But what you can also do is click on the search icon and then here search for wherever you want to park. Now, once you are at that location, you can see the car right there and you will see how much it costs. Now you can also manually switch the location. For example, if I'm in this area, then I can simply enter that. And then from there, you can go and click on it. So just click on the area that is selected. And then from here, you can confirm the parking so you can see the location. Then you have your license plate. If you haven't added it yet, just go and add it. They can choose if you want it to be a personal or a business expense. And they can also choose to set an end time so that basically it ends automatically at that time. Now you do need to make sure that you are actually not parked there any more than at that time. Otherwise you can get a parking ticket. But for example, if it ends here for me, I can just click confirm and then it will end at that time. So that way you won't forget it. Now you can see the parking cost at the bottom. So this one is two euros and 60 cents per hour. And you can just click start parking and then you will be kind of registered and you are going to be built per hour that you are parked there. Now in the top right, you have the three lines. If you click on that from here, you can also add your vehicles. You can choose your payment method. So you can go and click change payment method. You can add a business account, etc. You can also see your activity, your account, and there is a feature camera park, which is quite helpful. So basically, if you activate the automatic camera park, whenever you start parking somewhere, the camera detects your license plate and it will start the app automatically for you and also stop it when you exit and any barriers will open automatically. If you want to activate that, you can click start activation and then choose the vehicles for which you want to activate it. So that's basically how to use the Easy Park app. So just download it and open it and it will find your location and see if it is on the correct place. So for example, if I zoom in here, let's say I'm right here, then just click on it and then click start parking. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.